What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video, and tonight, we're going to talk about it, man. We're going to talk about it, as I told you guys earlier, your boy, Ghost, Amari Hardwick, the NAACP Image Awards, he kissed Beyonce, not once, but twice, and it's, you know, it's a lot of stuff going on on the internet. They killing him, man. The Beehive is killing him all over the internet. Now, in the comments... Let me know how you feel about this, how you feel about your boy um, Amari's actions. What do you think of it? Do you think he should apologize? You know, what's your intake on the whole situation? But like I said, the beehive is killing him. He he went in for the first little kiss. They hugged. Then he came back and damn near kissed her in the mouth. I mean, he was very close to her mouth and social media went crazy. Now, he, he you know... He dapped up. I don't even think he dapped up Jay Z, but he kind of just walked past him. They took a picture together, but as you can see, social media has went crazy. At this person right here, you don't have the tax bracket to double kiss Beyonce. Try that shit again, and you gonna lose your life. The Beehive ain't no joke, man. They be going in on people. They goes in. You tried my queen with that second kiss. You fine, but you ain't that fine. Count your days. And then this fan pretty much just said that Beyonce was only uncomfortable because Jay Z was right there, and that pretty much she was turned on. She was she got wet or whatever. She just she just felt uncomfortable because Jay Z was right there. I mean, you got a mixture of people. Rarely did I see anybody um, defending Amari. People was pretty much saying that what he did was overboard. He just pushed it entirely too much. Um, you got other people, the beehive pretty much saying he just he just took it too far with the second kiss. He should have just chilled out with the second kiss. People telling him to count his days. Um, as you can see, people bringing up the Me Too movement, which I was just talking about a couple of days ago. But the Me Too movement about how men just think they can just go around doing whatever they want to females. So here it is once again. You know what I'm saying? What's going to happen with this? I don't know if it's going to blow up. If it's going to get even more serious than this. Um, I'm kind of waiting on Amari to probably, you know, pretty much just come out and talk about it, probably apologize or whatever. I'm waiting to see his his reaction to this because I know he see it. They all on his comment section and his Instagram page. They going in on him, man. They going in on him. Uh, my thoughts is this. If I'm there, I won't even, you know, I'm not, I don't live that Hollywood lifestyle. Um, I... I, I don't even, you know, I don't even think it's cool for cats to even hug other dudes, girls, and kiss them in, in the first place. You can hug and everything and say hi or whatever, but, you know, in Hollywood, they be hugging them, kissing them, and I guess that's how they live. You know, that's just how they do it. But I couldn't do that, man. I could not have my girl hugging up on all these different dudes, and they they getting in those little small kisses. Me, personally, I just can't do it. I understand that's the lifestyle of Hollywood, but... Where I'm from, we don't do that. You know what I'm saying? We do not do that. And, you know, you know, Maury, my boy, Ghost. You know, I'm always going to defend him. Um, but with this one, I felt like, yeah, he probably shouldn't have done He shouldn't have done that, man, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he should have went for that second kiss. I can understand the first one. I was like, hi, boom, kiss, that's it. But the second one, it makes it seem like it's like, ah, you know, in the back of my head, I'm just like, nah, come on, don't do it, dude. Don't do it. He and he went for it. You know what I'm saying? He went for it. She did look uncomfortable, man. She was she was almost shocked in a in way. She kind of played it off a little bit, but you can tell she was uncomfortable because Jay-Z, he was right there. He was sitting right there, you know. And like I said, right before that, Amari pretty much he took a picture with Jay. Someone said he didn't even shake his hand. As you can see in the video, he kind of like took the picture. Jay-Z was about to trying to reach out and get the handshake, but he walked right past. And went in for the hug, got the first little kiss. After that, came back in, damn near kissed her on her lips. It was very close. It was very close. Like I said, I don't know his true intentions or what, or whatnot or whatever. I don't know how much him and Beyonce know each other. Someone, one of the uh, people tweeted that, 
he doesn't even follow her or whatever. So I don't know if he follows her on social media. You know, these fans, they be looking at all types of stuff. But, you know, me personally, I wouldn't have done it. I would have just played it cool, you know, left it at that. I felt like she was uncomfortable. It was very awkward. Um, if that was my girl, I'd be kind of like, damn, like, I would want to have a word with him. Like, dude, you good? Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't really have to do that twice. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to overreact. I really want to know how do y'all feel about this? Are y'all with the beehive? You know what I'm saying? Are y'all with the beehive? Do you think your boy Ghost did too much? He acting now his true character. He's like, fuck it. I'm going to take, take it just like I took Angela. I don't care. I'm going to do what I want to do. You know, I run this. I'm Ghost. He was acting his true character. Someone, I think somebody put out like, he better stop playing before they get power canceled. Doing, he doing way too much. I seen somebody tweet that, tweet that or whatever. But at the end of the day, like I said, I don't know if they're going to blow this up. You know, every week is something new. Other than that, I just feel like maybe, yeah, he can come out and just apologize. That he, he meant nothing intentional. He was just trying to show love. It is what it is. Move on. Some people, they ain't going to take that apology. They're going to be like, nah, they ain't good enough. You know what I'm saying? That's not good enough. But. I wanted to talk about it. Like I said, get your guys' intake. You guys can debate in the comment section. Let me know. Let the people know how you feel about this whole Amari Hardwick, Beyonce incident, um, the NAACP Image Awards. And you, you know he took a, he got two awards because you know Power won Best Drama and he got um, Outstanding Actor in the Drama. So they walked away successfully, man. But... You know, it's always something in Hollywood, man. They call it Holly Weird because all types of crazy shit be happening. But um, you guys let me know. Did your boy Ghost take it too far? Did he take it too far? I think he kind of did. He kind of just played it a little bit cool. You know what I'm saying? But who knows? But like I said, keep supporting your boy. I will continue to bring you more power content later on, like I said, be looking out. I won't be surprised if they give us a power um, behind the scenes or, you know, maybe like a first look like they did last year. I remember last year they gave us like a 30 second scene with Tommy Ghost and Kanan in the car or whatever. So don't be surprised if they give us something like that very soon. But I ain't gonna keep y'all too long, man. It's your boy Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.